My name is Kenneth Quinnell, and I teach uh, political science classes at the college level, and I'm the blogger known as Quinnell K at Florida Progressive Coalition and many other places. Okay, excellent. <laughs> um, can you please explain how you believe your life will be affected by the decisions of this administration? Well, as an educator, it's clear that the governor's priorities have nothing to do with making sure that Floridians are educated and prepared for the workforce and prepared for dealing with the real things that the economy brings to them. And what that means is that when the economy is bad, it's very difficult for new jobs to come into the state because the workforce is not educated and trained the way that companies would want them to be. So unless the company uh, is someone who is friends with the governor, they're not coming to Florida because every other state at this point has better educated workforce and they're not going to go for the crappiest workers possible, which is what we're apparently shooting for. So it's the case that a jobs agenda and an education agenda actually can go hand in hand? Not only can they go hand in hand, they're the exact same thing. There is no separation because the best workers are educated workers. Educated workers not only understand and perform their jobs better, they also show up to work more often. They're less likely to call in sick. They're less likely to take, uh, you know, personal or vacation days. They they're have a higher level of productivity. That when people are educated, they're better workers across the board universally. And anyone who really understands the way business works knows that you want educated workers or you're not going to have a good workforce.